We are looking at some sunshine starting to peek through, but still some patchy fog in a lot of spots. Yeah, so be careful out there. Some of the southern counties, some of the western counties yeah. around Kentucky have fog advisories this morning. They sure do, but it's not going to be with us for long, and neither with the clouds that are currently off to our east. It's all going to clear out before another round of clouds move yeah, in tonight. Yeah, definitely so. So we'll watch that. But yeah, some sunshine out there for us as we make our way through the day ahead. But right now we're starting with cloud cover from Nashville back over to the east as we see here from Cookville. But meanwhile, we've got fair skies right now as you head over to Clarksville and back over toward the Hopkinsville area. But this is what's up for us for the day ahead. Patchy fog now. That burns off some sunshine coming in for us into the afternoon. And then Thursday through Friday, highs between 75 and 80 above the norm of 67. So as you get ready to walk out the door today, pushing up to about 71 this afternoon. Winds light west and becoming north at about 5 to 10. Sunrise 709 sunset. 551 all that changes this weekend as we go into time change weekend we will fall back very early on Sunday morning. When you do that, change the batteries and the smoke detectors too this weekend. Here are the highs for you this afternoon. Also good weather if you need to get out and to rake the leaves. 66 at noon, 71 at the 3 o'clock hour. Temperatures above normal and looking out 6 to 10 days. Nikki D right now looks like this milder <laughs> weather will continue at least out to the next six to 10 days. Yeah, and Leland, you know, the typical average for this time of year, we're in the mid to upper 60s to top out, and that is not in the forecast over the next seven days. And even the anticipated six to 10 day range, as Leland just showed you. Sky 5 Live giving us some cotton candy skies. Look at the Cumberland, still on the lower end, but very nice, peaceful, almost looks like glass. And you can tell we do have some patchy fog in place this morning. This eventually will evaporate out, but we do have some dense fog advisories in a handful of spots. The clouds that are currently with us, they're going to move on out, allowing plenty of sunshine to be with us this afternoon. If you've got errands to run, this is your day. You're a school teacher. Let the kids play. It is going to be a very lovely afternoon. Dry conditions, even though we need the rain, will be dry, so outdoor activities good as gold. We'll start to see some clouds moving in this evening that will bring a slim chance, very low, but there, chance for one or two spotty showers ahead of tomorrow's sunrise. By sunrise tomorrow, all these clouds will continue to move their way out. So rainfall chances only around 10%. The bulk of us won't notice a thing. Rain chance wise, slightly better rain chances will move in as we head Sunday into Monday. But you can tell as the system moves this way eastward, it breaks up a lot. Models are in agreement of that. It's just all about how much rain can we get here. Your seven day forecast highs today 71. Clouds overnight, slim chance for one or two spotty showers. Then we have clearing taking place as we make our way into tomorrow. Lila, we're flirting with 80 degrees by the end of our work week. Yeah, look at that. 78 Friday, 79 Saturday. Right now we'll put in that rain chance in for Sunday and for Monday. I mean, even just one or two drops uh -huh. would do us good at yes. this point.